just people curious, obviously. We spoke to one woman who identified one of the victims as her 15 year old niece, Natasia. But I just had dinner with them yesterday evening. I cook for them every Thursday when they get out of school. So. She says her niece was in the band, an A honor roll student. She doesn't know why they were near the water. I have no idea. Well, they say the band, they, they was down here with the band. Um, down here with the band, they was going, I don't know whether, whether they were going to practice. They weren't going to practice down here, but they got out of school today early. Three high school kids uh, were out here by the river this afternoon. Uh, all three fell in. One was able to be self-rescued. The other two were not. It was about two and a half hours before the bodies of an unidentified male and female student were recovered with the help of Tuscaloosa's dive team. No lifeguards on duty and, and it is a hazardous area. It just is, it's, it's a very tragic. This is the worst day ever, you know, to have the young kids out in the river. And as a result of this horrible tragedy, Demopolis postponed its football game for this evening. We spoke with the Alabama High School Athletic Association and were told it will be rescheduled for tomorrow morning. In studio, Lee Garner, CBS 42 News local coverage you can count on. Lee, thank you. Some